What's up guys and welcome back in this video I'm gonna be showing you how to get iOS 11 features on your jailbroken device in iOS 10 so all the features that I'm about to show you in iOS 11 you can get them as tweaks using Cydia so without any further ado let's go ahead and check them out in the settings bar the signal dots has been replaced by bars in iOS 11 and you can get the same thing in iOS 10 using a tweak called bars it's available on Cydia and it replaced the dots with bars. You can now in iOS 11 select multiple icons and move them on the springboard so you tap and hold on the icon and you move it a little bit and you start choosing the icons that you wanna move along with the one that you have chosen and we already have this functionality on our jailbroken devices using a tweak called multi icon mover is available on the big boss repo and it allows you to move multiple applications at once simply enter the jiggle mode and select multiple icons to move them on the other's home screen the ipad in ios 11 has a new dock which allows you to add unlimited icons on it and you can get the same functionality in ios 10 using a tweak called harbor and it allows you to add more icons on the dock in addition to more animations and it's compatible with not only the iPad but also the iPhone. The dark mode has arrived to iOS 11 system widely and of course it darkens the widgets in the spotlight as you can see and also the banner notifications when you receive them you will get a dark mode as well and of course there is a tweak that can do so in iOS 10 called Noctis as you can see it darkens the, the widgets and the spotlight and also banner notifications as you can see right here it's available on the big boss repo and also we have the dark mode within the applications in iOS 11 as you can see and you can already get the dark mode in iOS 10 using a city we called Eclipse 4 it has the dark mode not only that but also colors to customize the color of the interface in iOS 11 you have the ability to record your screen using the control center or a functionality in the control center which is this one right here you tap on it and now you can record your screen using this feature but in iOS 10 it was a hidden feature but thanks to a tweak called CC record available on the big boss repo it enables that icon in the control center as you can see in iOS 10 staying in the control center in iOS 11 we have an additional toggle for the low power battery mode if you tap on it you can enable the low power mode straight from the control center in iOS 11 but we already have this feature in iOS 10 using a Cydia tweak called CC Low Power which adds a toggle or a switch for the low power battery mode as you can see to quickly turn it on in iOS 10 in iOS 11 now you have the ability to scribble and draw on your screenshot that you have taken as you can see and using Cydia you can get scriblets in iOS 10 to get the same functionality as you can see you can drop draw on your screen this video as you can see same thing in iOS 11 that's it for this video guys I hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't for new content thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next one